be a part of our free flip camera giveaway. All you have to do is subscribe to our channel and like our videos. Comment on them and share us on Facebook and Twitter. After we reach 1,000 subscribers, one lucky winner will win this custom flip video camera. Good luck. And enjoy the show. Come on down, it's time to begin. Time to make a sandwich with two naked men. Hello, and welcome to Two Naked Men Making a Sandwich. Yeah, whatever. Taylor, you know, you need to cheer up. You and Dominic need to get your differences out of the way, okay? I mean, the only reason why I'm doing this episode is because Howie from Howie Reporting Live thought we were one and the same person. Really? Yeah. That's crazy. We don't even look alike. Not even a little. We do sound the same on the telephone, though. It's kind of weird. Yeah? Yeah. It is weird. Anyway, today we're going to make buffalo toes. No, silly. We're making a Mardi Gras tradition muffaletta sandwich. Today we're making a muffaletto sandwich. Muffaletta? Muffaletta. Muffaletta yeah. sandwich. Go over the ingredients, silly. I'm going to go over the ingredients. That's what I said the first time. Our ingredients today are a thickly cut ham, about a pound of it. We also have prosciutto. We normally would use mortadella on this sandwich, but since the prefix of that is death, we decided to go with something a little bit more pro-positive. About a quarter pound of that. Genoa salami. It's delicious. And about a quarter pound of that. Provolone cheese, thinly sliced. Italian bread in the round. Olive mix pureed. Okay, now let's get it all together. Now first, we're going to start with our bread. Now, Taylor misspoke a little bit. This is actually Sicilian bread. All right. I know Sicily is in the country of Italy, but they definitely like to keep separate. You know, and so Sicilian bread is actually what we're using. Sicilian, kind of like our chef Dominic. Alright, we're going to cut it right down the middle and we're going to add our olive mix. We definitely want to put this on both sides of the bread. Now, we chose to go with a pureed option because we don't want the chunks of olive getting stuck in our teeth. How embarrassing would that be? This is also better for our older viewers who have dentures. The olive mix is a blend of Colorado olives, black and green olives, as well as oil, garlic, and other spices. Now we're going to pass it over to Taylor so he can apply his meat. What do you got there? What? No, this isn't a Dominic voodoo doll. Well, that doesn't work. Well, how did you get the hair for it anyhow? I don't want to talk about it. Too traumatic. Salami. Well, let's 
put the roof on top of this and dig into the baby. Now look at this big beauty. Hmm. And if having this much bread is too sinful for you, just go ahead and take your top off. But remember, it's what's on the inside that counts. That was the show, but it had to end. We just made a sandwich with two